Hey everybody, it's LTM here. I am at the Hall Cinema 7 right now, and I'm about to go and watch Strays. Um, so when I first saw the trailer for this, the only thing that popped in my mind was like, oh, so this is like 101 Dalmatians meets Homeward Bound, but for adults, rated R. So um, when going into that, especially with this having Will Ferrell and Jamie Foxx in it, I knew this was gonna be a real goofball. Uh, I don't think it'll be anything great, but I don't think it'll be anything good either. So this will be very interesting to check out. Um, so I'm going to go in, buy my ticket, and give you all my thoughts when I come back. This is LTM, and I'll be right back. Hey, guys. Uh, just got out of Strays. Um, I love dog movies. First of all, I know I didn't say this in the beginning, but I love dog movies. From watching the trailer, it looked like Homeward Bound meets 101 Dalmatians. Um... I did grew up watching a lot of cartoons based off pets like Garfield and Tom and Jerry. So I do have a little bit of connection with dog movies. Um, this film, guys, I'm just gonna say I had a blast in this movie. It's not perfect. And it's and I can kind of see why, what, why the movie is so mixed with everybody, but let me explain. So the movie stars Will Ferrell as a, a dog who's being, a, who lives with a owner named Doug who abuses him, Doug hates him, he wishes he was never, he never adopted him and stuff like that. And basically one day, um, he he takes Reggie, I guess that's what, that's his name, and basically takes him out to the, out in the street and then leaves him there by, by throwing a ball at him, which is called Fetch. Well, he, they call it something else, but basically uh, Reggie ends up getting lost and it, and it turns out in theory, he thinks that he's doing it playing as a game, but really he, he's not. And then he meets this pup this other dog, Bugsy or Bubsy or something like that. Bugsy played by Jamie Foxx. And these other two dogs, one of them played by Randall Park. Randall Park, I think. Randall Parker, something like that. It, it's the guy from uh, Ant-Man and the Wasp, one of the actors from Ant-Man. So basically they go on this quest uh, to go um, to get revenge on, uh, on Reggie's owner. Uh, so the movie kind of reminds me a lot of those old Disney cartoons with the dogs getting revenge on their owners. Um, the movie feels like a satire of that. It's it's not like Sausage Party where it's more like a, okay, so there it's 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 a commentary, or, or where it parodies the common trends on family on the family films follow. Which you could argue that Strays is kind of one of those movies, but basically Strays is more like a satire on those dog movies that that we had in the two thousands. Like uh, like like it's not just Homeward Bound. It reminds me a lot of movies like Show Dogs or um, what's that other one? Um, a Dog's Purpose. In fact, they parody the whole narrating thing like you see in A Dog's Purpose, so I like that. Um, basically, um, the goods... Now, not every joke lands, but I will say, I don't think I've ever heard any... I don't think I've heard this much genital jokes in any comedy in my life. Because, yeah, the, the ju there's a lot of juvenile, crude toilet humor in this. And if you're not going to dig this... If you're not going to like that, you're not going to dig this movie out. Um... This movie is really funny. It's not clever by any means. It's, there's, there's no really funny, clever lines in this. But if you just like... For me, I had a, I have a really good sense of humor, so I don't mind toilet humor unless if it's done right. And while Strays kind of fails at that at times, it does try. And I gotta... And the things that it does, it's pretty nuts. Um, the characters are very likable. I like Will Ferrell and Jamie Foxx's chemistry. They do a really good job nailing any, at each other. Um, I just like watching dogs just go around and exploring the world. That's just, that's just, it's so engaging. And usually it doesn't always work, but here, thanks to the R rating and the fact that this is kind of trying to be a parody of those dog movies from Disney, it kind of feels like that. Um, the movie has a really good soundtrack. It's a lot of hip hop sort of soundtrack. That's, that's my kind of taste. Um, I do like, um, the voice acting on the dogs. Uh, the, the actors do a pretty good job, mostly from Will Ferrell, Jamie Foxx, and, um, Will, um... Will, it's not, it's another Will, it's another Will, Will Ford or something like that, I forgot his name, it's the guy who plays uh, Reggie's owner, basically I I really enjoyed the, the acting in this, it's really good, I didn't know where it was going to go half of the time, so, and I like that movies that do that, they constantly guess of where it was going to go, so, not a great movie overall, but if you just want to see dogs go explore in the world, world like in something like Homeward Bound, or but with an R rating, You'll like this movie. If you're a dog lover or if you like those late night comedies as well, like Wedding Crashers or The Hangover, 
I will guarantee you'll like this movie. If you can't stand the juvenile humor, or you just just thought the tra or if you saw the trailer, you just thought it looked stupid. Don't go see it. But the movie delivered what it promised from the trailers, and I expected something like this. So, I give Strays a seven out of ten. Is a great no, but it's one of those movies where I'm gonna have to come back and watch just to have a good laugh. All right, guys, so that's Strays for you. This will probably be the last movie I'm gonna go watch for a while until I come back from my trip. I've got too much stuff going around in September, a lot of personal stuff going on. So Strays will probably be the last one I'm gonna be going to go see for a while. Gran Turismo, uh, Expendables 4, um, I will get to those probably just if I come back, but I probably won't do vlogs on them. I'll just probably post my reviews on like other social media, which I have a Facebook account. So if y'all want to go check that out, go ahead. Uh, but anyways, um, hope you guys enjoyed this review. What's your favorite dog movie? Please subscribe, comment below, let me know. This is LC Sayan. I'll see you guys later.